Today, we will be showing one of the classical problems of synchronization. In this scene, we are depicting a sleeping barber. Now, we will be showing starvation and deadlock. First, we will show the situation where the customer A enters the barber shop to get his haircut. This is the deadlock situation. Wake up barber. The customer A sees the barber sleeping. Then he wakes up the barber. The barber starts cutting his hair. Suddenly, customer B enters the room and sees that the barber is still cutting customer A's hair. Then the customer B decides to go to the wedding. A few moments later. After a short time, when the barber is not coming, the customer B decides to leave the waiting room temporarily. The barber finishes cutting the customer A's hair. Thank you. After finishing cutting the customer A's hair, the barber goes to the waiting room. But there is nobody waiting in the waiting room. After realizing the waiting room is empty, the barber continues to sleep. A few seconds later, the customer B again enters the waiting room. Over here you can see that the customer is waiting in the waiting room and the barber is sleeping. This is how starvation occurs. Suddenly, customer C enters the barber shop and wakes him up. Wake up. Now, as you can see, customer B is still waiting while the barber is concurrently working on the new customer, the customer C. The solution of the sleeping barber problem is that we use three semaphores. One, for the customer, that is, for, the, for keeping the count of the waiting customers. Second, is for the barber, that is, the binary mutex, which is used to keep the state of the barber. Third, is the mutual exclusion semaphore that is used for keeping the count of the seats. Thank you.